Welcome, everybody, to the Riverview Cafe and Wine Bar. Thank you all for being here. Let's thank the Riverview for hosting us tonight. The, they're open late. They've got the full bar of sweets over there. And quiches are good. Everything's good. So get on over there and get a drink and relax. You're, I'm very happy to have you all here tonight. This is a very important and special evening for me. We're celebrating a special song for a special dog. And the dog is my uh, Doberman Pinscher. As you guessed, her name is Ruby. She's not here tonight. She sends her love. It's hard to host a show with her running around and whining, but she said be home by 10.30. So she's doing good, and uh, I'll give you the whole story as the night goes on, but we'll just get the ball rolling. Uh, I think there's no better way to start the evening than by introducing... Uh, the leading lady this way. Her bells and whistles are her scorching lyrics and searing vocal delivery. Her vibe is older than old school and as fresh as the new world for women in music. Folk punk, rock gospel, take the medicine she administers and free your soul. Eight studio albums, all for sale over there, of original true to the heart songs that bypass all falseness, all pretense. On electric or acoustic guitar, you're gonna get both tonight, with a full band, Rob is a full band, or absolutely alone on the stage. This powerful woman will rule the day and the night. Tonight. Her backstory is mythic, escaping from an insane family situation in Chicago to the north woods of Minnesota where she obsessed at 17 over the recordings of Bob Dylan. In a deserted cabin all alone, a second escape from an early marriage to her lead guitarist at 21. Didn't know about that one. Courtney, we'll have to fill me in on that one later on. Many songs written, sung in little coffee shops and working class bars for years. One more grand escape, losing the mean doctor husband who said she was too old to have a career in music and that she was making a fool of herself to try. She took the three kids with her when she left. The kids are grown now and she is a full-time touring and recording artist. She has a promise on her lips and a dream in her eyes since she wrote and performed her first song at a big church in Chicago when she was 10 years old. She is making good on her dream, a dream that encompasses 50 years of the great American songbook, a dream that gives hope and inspiration to all. It is my pleasure to introduce Courtney Yasmine. Alright, alright, alright. But I need to move this so I can get good genes. Alright. 